What's up guys, Fakir from PIP Shop Management. This is a tutorial video on how to use your phone, whether your iPhone or your Android phone to take pictures and use them directly with VIP Shop Management. The good news, I feel like, you know, Microsoft worked for me sometimes. So they created an app, it's called OneDrive. And I'm gonna show you where you can download it and then set it up with you. And once you just take a picture, it'll be automatically on your computer or multiple computers as long as you're signed in to the same OneDrive account. Just quick reminder, what is OneDrive? We're gonna go to your folder option right here and right there, this, this cloud right there, this blue cloud, sorry. Just, if you don't have a name next to it, just right click on it, go to OneDrive and go to settings and there you can create an account or sign in either or. So let me bring my phone right here. I'm gonna bring in my phone. We're gonna go to the App Store. This is an iPhone, by the way. We're gonna search for OneDrive. It's gonna say Microsoft OneDrive. We're gonna download it. And we're gonna set it up. The, make sure, like obviously, like I said, you gotta have, make sure you have just one account. And uh, that account is for business only, for business purposes. And when you download that app on your phone, make sure it has limited access. You don't want it, your personal pictures to be shared. So go to open app right here. I'm already signed in, that's fine. Basically at this step, you're supposed to like, you know, type in your username and password. I'm already signed in. It's gonna try to sell you something, just X that. And then it's gonna say, keep up with files and no thanks. And then it's gonna say, turn on camera upload, okay. However, it's gonna say full access. Nope, you click on continue and then click on limited access. Very important step. Limited access basically says that, you know, you're only gonna upload the pictures that I take, not my personal pictures from like your own camera or whatever the case is. And then click on done. And at this moment, it's gonna say import. No, nope, maybe later. And then just click on the camera click allow you get a scroll I still don't know if there's a way we, you need we need to scroll to the photo I don't know why it starts the opposite maybe you can go to settings we'll check that out but basically this is it let me just take a picture of my drink right here and we just took this picture and let's see and we're gonna click on done at this moment it's gonna ask you where do you want to save these pictures just go to you just go to files right here and to camera roll and just choose this folder and okay so we'll see the picture is right there let's see if this the picture is already on the computer right here let me move this aside go to pictures right here add pictures click on photos and here's your pictures and now we'll, with all the full functionalities that we have you can click on SMS and select images, select the photo, attach estimate with images and send it. And this is how it's gonna look like. Let's bring this right here. There we go. And then, or if you wanna email, you just go to email and then request approval and then select images right there. And you can attach the image to the email itself up to five images let me find myself or you can use the tablet but yes the whole basic thing is can even your your like your your mechanic uh, take use their own phone to take pictures of the you know vehicle and upload them automatically without doing anything yes and yes and yes the, the, the app it's called OneDrive whether on your Android or, uh, or iPhone, or you can use a tablet and take pictures directly. Regardless, all computers must be signed in to the same account. OneDrive must be a business, always limited access. Keep your personal pictures away. Anyway, I appreciate it guys. Until next time, thanks for watching.